Professor, this is not so much a question, uh, but earlier on you skipped that part about the dumping down yes. effect. Okay, this is something that um, I was hoping that you would be able to share because I, I see that, you know, with the rush to provide um, so-called customized information uh, to meet the needs of the, the, the largest common denominator, there appears to be a dumping down of content, um, not just in media, but I think it, uh, with any publisher. Yeah, there are two, um, and forgive me if I'm cutting you off a little bit here, there are two uh, counterintuitive things we've noticed. One is that the competition, people are picking content not based on high quality, but just if it's good enough to use, that YouTube effect I mentioned, where it doesn't have to be perfect quality content, video content, as long as it's good enough to use, people will use it, and actually they'll use whoever's the first to give them good enough content. But the other one, the dumbing down, um, actually one of the reasons I skipped that is that I often talk about how in this transitional time, when we're still using mass media business models to make money, where the larger the audience, the more money you make, as the audience is fragmenting among all these various new choices they have, the audiences are becoming smaller. And many companies, and forgive me, particularly broadcast ones, I'll pick on them, are starting to dumb down their content in a way to find a low low lower common denominator of content so they can raise up their numbers of audiences. And the example I frequently give is the bio biography channel which used to be biographies of Einstein, Newton, Picasso, but now if you go to the same content, same channel, it's biographies of Madonna, Britney Spears, Jim Carrey. And of course, they have a larger audience, which is why they're doing it. And I've become a little leery of talking about the dumbing down effect of media in that way, because uh, two weeks ago in New York, I moderated a conference that my own school was running, and I gave that example from the biology, or the biography channel. And then I segued to introducing the next speaker, who is the chairman of Discovery Communication, who is, of course, the broadcaster of Biography Channel. <laughs> that didn't go over too well. So uh, right now I'm a little gun shy of talking about that one point, but that is happening right now and it's not helping things and not helping some of these issues, unfortunately. But it is an effect we're seeing in the media.